The state weights and measures, they certify our scales every year. Everything that comes on the ranch, everything that goes off the ranch goes over my scale. So all of our truck scales are certified, all of our dirt scales on our pilers are certified. They're going to check our meters, proof them. He weighs railroad cars, he weighs chickens in Albertsons, and then he goes out and measures how many gallons of fuel comes out of that pump. They got a lot to cover. The standard of weights and measures is so vital in our country that the framers specifically spoke of it in Article 1, Section 8 of the U.S. Constitution. Montanans recognized the significance and established a weights and measures program the same year our state was founded, in 1889. If your scale doesn't work, you don't have a sale. You know, we're kind of a hub for northern part of the state, eastern part of the state, as far as people that bring their cattle here. So they gotta know that they're bringing their cattle to a reputation sale barn with a accurate scale. We could run 7,000 head through here and we gotta have a scale that works. The Weights and Measures mission is to ensure that the market is fair. Consumers are not paying for more product than they receive and businesses are not giving away product. Weights and Measures tries to ensure that in every commercial transaction involving weight or volume, neither the buyer nor the seller has an advantage. So we're having the State Bureau of Weights and Measures come out. It's an awesome opportunity for both the consumer and our company uh, just to ensure that our customers are getting exactly what they're paying for and that we're not giving away propane. We purchase beets from our growers Everything that we bring in, weigh, clean, weigh again, you know, the confidence that everything that they're doing in these labs, it's all certified and, you know, accurate. We run a cattle outfit down here and we use the scales for mainly cattle. We do weigh a little bit of grain on them now and then. The scale is limited to about 40,000 pound weight, so we don't let anybody on there that weighs more than that. Uh, we were weighing some cattle one time, and the guy said, oh, them cattle weigh more than that. And, and I said, well, this little sticker right here says that this is still good. And you can see it finding itself. A lot of times uh, throughout the year, even when it's not a scheduled uh, time for the state to come, we'll call the state just to check our meters if we have any question at all about our meters. Weights and measures, I think, gives the public more confidence. It's peace of mind for our growers. Our growers actually own the company and this is all their product that we're dealing with. So those guys just come in, they do their job, they mail me my licenses and it's been a very good working relationship. He knows when he needs to be here and I don't have to worry. 